Here in the Escraves Anchorage is empty praisal, a subject of controversy in Nigeria's oil and gas industry in the past one week. The Joint Task Force, codenamed Operation Delta Safe, says the motor tanker has the approval of the Nigerian Midstream and Downstream Petroleum Regulatory Authority to load 1,114,721 litres of high pore fuel oil, HPFO, from Greenmark Energy Storage at Terrace Jetty in Coco. Delta State, an approval also confirmed by the Navy. However, on the 2nd of August, Tantita Security Services reportedly boarded the vessel, suspecting it to be laden with crude oil. Pipeline surveillance contractors, including Tantita, are only to provide credible intelligence to the OPDS elements working with them and are not permitted to independently carry out operations or intercept and arrest any vessel. It is noteworthy that in this case, Tantita did not intercept or arrest empty Prezo, but the vessel was directed to proceed to Anchorage for investigation. Samples of the products were taken for tests by various agencies. This include the Nigerian Navy, the Tantita, and of course, the regulatory authority in Nigeria today, which is the NMDPRA. The results of the test have now been received and confirmed that the product on board empty Prezo is HPFO as approved by NMDPRA and not crude oil as suspected. Showing the results of the test samples, the commander of the South-South Joint Task Force, Rear Admiral Olusegun Ferreira, says Operation Delta Safe is a willing partner in the protection of Nigeria's oil and gas assets. OPDS also remains ready to work with all partners, stakeholders and credible industry players to protect oil and gas infrastructure and our common patrimony for the economic prosperity of Nigeria. This is also in recognition that addressing crude oil theft is a whole of society approach and we enjoin all genuine sources to provide timely, credible and reliable intelligence to support our operations. Rear Admiral Ferreira restates the JTF's mandate to display diligence, transparency, synergy and professionalism in accordance with the mandate and directive of the Chief of Defence Staff. Ovietime George, Arise News.